Hey guys, my name is Sam Snight, and welcome back to Vampire. I don't think Refill All does anything that are on full-on ammo and have been for the entire game. Um, still learning the game. Uh, oh. I guess... Oh, okay. Whoa. Oh, damn it. Ow. Shit, okay, they're both level 14. Oh, but I'm, like, murdering them. Alright, that's fine. That was kind of a quick... Oof. Ow. That was a big hit. Big hit, big hit. Not gonna lie, not gonna lie. Hurts a lot. Get off me. Get off me. Stop being alive. Oh, shit. That didn't go as planned. I got him where I want him. Kinda. Shit! Shit! Stop being alive. Damn. That was rough. All about- everything about that was rough. I can understand why this guy died. Uh, I need to find the inhabitants of White Chapel. In White Chapel, rather. Now, there was a thing in, on one of the loading screens saying that if the if enough people die, the district will fall into chaos and dangerous creatures will start roaming the streets. What I assume that means is if I plunge it into chaos, I get even more experience by letting big monsters out, allowing me to level up even further. Am I taking this the wrong way? Probably Scuba's asleep right there. Oh, you probably can't see her. Um, I just really am on the fence about how dark to be. There are some people I'm going to kill, without a doubt. It's locked. There are some people I will not kill. There are some people I'm on the fence about. Let me let me back up there, would you? Oh, is this open now? Okay, that's good. So I need to get on the other side. So here we are with the uh, going back and forth kind of thing. My bad. I didn't mean to do a loading screen. I didn't need to do. Hmm. Yeah. See, Whitechapel. I don't want to be rocking the boat too much here because this place is already kind of falling apart. Oh, got stuff. Can I upgrade? Gotta be a workbench here, right? Uh, I don't even see the bed anywhere. Where's my shit? Where's all the hideout stuff? This is a hideout. Hmm. Where did everything go? That's weird. Okay. Uh, I still gotta find my way around, though, to get uh, behind that locked gate, I believe. Oh. This is where everything is. Can I upgrade? Uh, 121 damage. Uh. Oh, shit. Wait. That's not what I wanted. Damn it. I didn't mean to change that. I really didn't. Shit. Oh well, I need to stun them more anyway. Um, let's see. Did I miss all this stuff? Or does it just respawn? Is this an exit? No, it's not. This game, when it comes to a few things, it's a little, little confusing. Okay, now that I, I have found the door... Oh, here it is. If a district's health status drops below critical threshold, it will plunge into chaos. Citizens will be reported missing, their quests will be lost, and dangerous creatures will 
began to roam the streets. Sounds like an XP farm to me. Should I plunge a district into chaos to farm its experience? That could be interesting. Why does that happen? Clayton. What is Can I eat you? Forgive my interruption. Do not apologize, my son. Father Tobias Whitaker is always happy to teach mortals about the incoming Armageddon. I am Dr. Jonathan Reed, and I just have a few questions. A scientist? You are much more lost than I thought, my son. What do you mean? Do you know Nurse Dorothy Crane from the Pembroke Hospital? I'd like to know more about her. I don't like the liberal ideas of nurses, but I especially abhor that Nurse Crane you mentioned. So, you're not exactly a fan of Florence Nightingale's work. But nurses are essential for modern healthcare. Nuns should be the only women allowed to take care of male patients. It's obvious only they have a necessary moral fiber. Why do you hate Nurse Crane more than other nurses? It Oh shit. Why do you before coming to London? She was a member of the communist resistance in her country. That's what happens when you let a woman get involved in politics. I'm going to kill this guy. I hate him a lot. Have you any friends? Any family left in these terrible times? No. But I have a disciple I see as my son. He is so devoted. I sent him to preach the good word in the heart of this corrupted city. Where did you send him? I sent Samuel to the Stonebridge Cemetery, where the pestilence and evil grows night after night. You sent him on some preaching crusade during the epidemic? As a true believer, Samuel will fear no evil while he walks through the valley of the shadow of death. I hate this guy so much. What do you mean when you say that I am more lost than you thought? All scientists are entangled in a world of causes and consequences. And most of them can't see the plain truth. Quite a judgmental opinion, if you ask me. But what do I know? Blinded by science as I am. Well, you are seeking answers, aren't you? Answers about the Armageddon about to strike the city. Answers about the hidden truth. Let's let's well, hear him out. I suppose I can spare a few minutes listening to your so-called truth. As a doctor, you must be aware of a decimating epidemic. But let me I don't need to be a doctor to realize everyone's dying. Flu. It's just the beginning of the end. What do you mean? The beast is finally revealing itself. Corrupting the flesh and the heart of men. With my own eyes, I have seen them. Those minions from the abyss. Really? And what would be your answer to this biblical threat? We must fight the disease before this legion outnumbers us. But not with scalpels and microscopes. No. What is left then? Cleansing fire. Okay. Tell me, Tobias, what exactly is your plan concerning the cleansing of this city? God will recognize his own. More than once this city has risen from the ashes, hardened and purified by the flames. Purification by fire has proved useful, but where do you stop? Burn the clothes? The buildings? The corpses? Worse? Your lack of faith is predictable. But my task is to convince rational minds like yours to see the light. This is God's will. You're mad and dangerous. You're nothing but a soulless butcher. A small-time Torquemada. The Savonarola of Whitechapel. My son, if you think salvation is a free gift, 
Go listen to the lies of that pompous fool, Joseph. Joseph, a fool. Vicar Larrabee of St. Mary's Church. While he continues preaching his fraudulent redemption, more and more people die in the streets. Hmm. What do you know? All quite a are you? I am. Ah, oh, damn it. I have had it. I am going to kill this guy. What's his name? Yeah, I'm I'm going to kill him. So, Excuse me, sir. Are you sorry? I'm Dr. Reed, the famous surgeon. Oh. I heard you are investigating an underground medical dispensary in Whitechapel. What do you know about it? Not much, I'm afraid. They are weary of strangers and I'm not really an acquaintance of theirs. Why do you care? I'm a doctor, Mr. Darby. I care about everything involving public health and this epidemic. Are you sure you're not just concerned about the repercussions that a scandal involving a certain nurse crane from the Pembroke Hospital would bring? Without a doubt, you are a damn fine journalist, Mr. Darby. What do you know of her accomplice, a man named Darius? I don't know much about the man. He's very cautious, never goes out, doesn't seem to have any friends or family. He never goes out? No. A few days ago, he unexpectedly did. I followed him, but it was just a ruse to keep me away from his house. Really? How do you know? He went to the nearest mailbox, but just before posting his letter, he ripped it up and threw it away. He has no relatives at all? No. Except for that strange man, a poet named Richard Nithercott, who sometimes comes by. Darius would never let him in. Where can I find this Mr. Nithercott? He spends most of his time lurking around Whitechapel, talking to himself or declaring verses. These days, you can usually find him behind the church. Okay. Goodbye, Mr. Darby. Wait a minute. Where's my list of quests? Local investigations, that's it. Uh Oh. Oh. I like this. See? I haven't done these yet. Oh, right. Oh, you can only track one at a time. All right, hang on. Before I keep this up, let me wrap up the side quest that I've started already. Why am I jumping ahead of myself? I apologize for that. And anyone who is screaming at me to do that instead. Oh, yeah. I know the district status, bro. You keep telling me. Can I fix that a little bit? Can I help improve it? Okay. <clears throat> Keeps calling me a leech. I'm gonna... Everything's fine. Just passing through. Damn it. What's in here? Is this a hideout? See, yeah, I forgot to do all the side quests. So now I'm going to backtrack a little bit before getting, like, ahead of myself. I don't want to just... Get, gather all these side quests and then so yeah remember uh, the, the kid he tried to k kill himself and he doesn't want anyone else reading his last his last word last words his suicide note he doesn't want anyone to read his suicide note so we're not gonna let that happen of course I'm gonna read it Oh, man. You know what it would be like to just murder one of these people and level up like 30 times? That's a massive exaggeration, but still. I need more stamina, man. 
That's what I'm after. Whoosh. Woo! I'll be going. I want you to know that. Oh, I don't want to read that. If you want to read it, you can letter, pause it. But Mortimer Goswick does nothing to hide his desire to die. I could give it to his mother, but doing so would betray his trust. Shit. Well, I'm gonna eat him anyway, so... Hmm. It's locked. It's locked. Damn it. What am I supposed to do with this stupid letter now? His mom's kind of a brat. I think the cats were fighting. Either way, let's see where I am. Okay. Can I take that? It looks like, oh, that's definitely not duct tape. Um, let's see. Hmm. I'm definitely going to start killing sick people because this hospital is on somewhat of red alert. And I know what Dracula would do. I know the dude better than I know myself. What Dracula would do would be whatever he had to do to keep the place going. Keep my own cover. S Whoa. I don't know how long I've been able to do that. Um... My cover needs to stay covered, so this hospital needs to stay standing. In order for this hospital to stay standing, it needs all the supplies it can get. How do you save supplies? Don't use supplies. Why wouldn't you need to use your supplies? Well, get rid of the reason you need them. Not all of them, but enough of them. How... Can I not... Hang on. Oh, do I not have enough blood for that? No, I, I... Oh, I can't do that here. Yeah, I know, buddy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna go... Find... Good. Glad you're confident. I don't know what to do here. She's a four. He's a two. She already knows. I'll give it to him. Good evening, Mr. Goswick. How are you? I'm okay. I have retrieved your letter, Mr. Goswick. I can assure you that nobody read it but me. Thank you. This is for you, then. For your help and for your silence I think you should talk to your mother it would be good for both of you thank you dr. Reed I'll think about it now please let me be okay I have to go can I cure her fatigue do you require medical attention? Do you know you're the only one who's asked me this? Despite what you think about this place, I can tell you with absolute certainty, taking this will help you recover. Well, at least your reputation seems well deserved. Goodbye, Mrs. Goswick. And now she's worth more. Or will be, anyway. I want to know who that guy is. I want to know more about him. Okay, let's uh, readdress the rest of the side quests. No, I, I did those. <laughs> no, no, the side quests. Here we go. Investigations. Yeah, see? This one. 
I have 32 meters to go that way. Oh, so that's like super close. So I should have done these already. Thelma Howcroft said she was being watched by vampire hunters. Where are they hiding? I should investigate. This should be like right here, bruh. I'm sorry, I've been saying bruh so much. Uh, my coworker Tim, who transferred to another branch, came back for this major outage that we're right in the middle of right now. And uh, he says bruh all the time, and seeing him again has just made me spend time around him at work, and now I'm saying bruh constantly. Oh, six and seven, that's cute. <laughs> what can I say? I annihilated them. Vampire activity three days ago. Da, 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 da. Okay, so they're on to her. But they're like not quite. Okay. 120 meters this way. Why can't the whole world use the metric system? Like, I don't really like the metric system, but if I was raised using it, I would have no problem with it. I need more stamina. Oh, look where we are. I'll go around. I have no problem murdering you, but I don't need to. That's fine. Best stay back, sir. That's fine. What are these? Stay away. I'm reading. You need to quit being an asshole to me. I'm just walking past you. Oh. I ain't never been here before. Before. Just forgot how to talk. Okay, so there's people. How do, hang on. That's where I need to be, right? Okay, this will get me there. By going the way I'm facing. Isn't this out? Ten. Let's turn around if I were you. Oi, yo, stop that! How do I get where I need to get? Okay, so what I need to do is backtrack to my back right. Oh, wait a minute. This shit's confusing. Okay. Um, see if I can find a way off to the left somewhere. Ain't not. I keep stunning the shit out of him, dude. Shit, that 
Oh, that was cool. Admit it, you were impressed. Okay, that happened. Now I came back here to try to go off to the left. Like this? Maybe? Now if I... Oh, I'm almost there. Okay. I can make it pretty loud up in here. I have a gun that I don't know how to use. Oh, wait. Wait, buddy, I was just walking. Straight, I'm gonna be real with you. I was just walking. Ow. See, I've noticed that biting is like you're immune to getting hit for a minute. And I'm using that to my advantage because I don't like being I don't like being hit. Just take this two-handed weapon takes a lot of stamina though. Oh. I'm going to eat you. And dead. And oh shit. And dead. Damn. Oh shit, 15. Oh god. Steal the reports leading to the Pembroke Hospital. Wow. Ah shit. I really didn't want to have to do this. <laughs> These guys are pretty strong. And he's dead. So, common handle part. Didn't I need those for something? Now, if there's a way to like get around them, I would like to know that because I don't like to take the time to fight them every single time. Oh, large box of pills. Okay. Oh. Hello. Oh, alright. I guess. There ain't no way this guy's gonna kill me. Not a chance. About to let that happen. Ooh, vampire activity there. Aha. Okay. What is this on the table here? I can't seem to grab it. Ooh, a steak. Alright. So. Now I gotta go all the way back to the hospital. Until, what's your face? Everything's chill, I killed everyone. There was another glowy. I got it, but it didn't say what it was. There it goes. I don't know what was in there either. <laughs> They beat the shit out of me, I'm not gonna lie. Alright, that was a fun side quest, I think. 
There's my room. That's convenient. The flower's dying. It needs water. If I find any type of water, it's getting it. Okay, um, no, I didn't want to do this. Um, I don't even think I really have enough. Yeah, I don't have enough points to do what I want to do. What I want to do is more stamina. I need a thousand for that. It would be nice to kill someone big, wouldn't it? Alright, I'm going to tell Thelma everything's fine. And every I was looking it up online, and people say that when it comes to affecting the story, the best way to, if you're gonna kill people, do their quest first, then kill them. So that way you get the story out of, out of them. You need to stop complaining. Good evening. Can I? Not I will. Okay, so I cannot cure him. Oh, I hate you. I will kill Harriet. If someone doesn't already lose their mind and do it for me. Good evening, Miss Halcroft. I need blood, Doctor. I have made inquiries about the men who were tracking you, Miss Halcroft. I did not expect a mortal to have this sort of courage. Speak, Doctor. Why are they hunting me down? It was a misunderstanding. These hunters were in fact looking for a very different creature. But they mistakenly put their sights on you. I knew it. I have become undone. Those hunters have discovered me. But they don't know what I'm capable of. If you'll accept some advice from a petty mortal, I think you should assume a low profile and just quietly disappear into the shadows. You are right. And you have served me well, mortal. Take this as a reward for your time. Perhaps I will allow you to drink deep of my blood. One day. Thank you. I'll keep that proposition in mind. Damn it. Okay, so... So far... Everything I've found out, I've done... Here, I've got to do this now. I'll leave you. Wait. Good evening. Can I? I cannot mesmerize. Damn it! So far, I've gotten everything done besides this one quest I'm headed towards now, and then I'm gonna continue with the main quest. We're doing good. We are doing good. I'm very much enjoying myself playing this game. I feel like I'm taking my time with it, and at first I was like, ooh, I should probably like get a move on. This is kind of a long game. And then I realized that's stupid. I'm going to relax, and I'm going to enjoy the game for what it is. Where is this? Oh, okay. So you're back this way. No, I didn't want to go indoors. Damn it. Why do I always do that? And I mean, I'll go to the other end of it now, but it's kind of annoying. I'm really digging this game. Uh, there's a possibility I might farm experience between episodes. Just because extra experience is good. It's locked, all right. What? What's happening in here? Oh. oh shit, oh well. Itchy nose. I'm gonna eat you. Oh, I have uh, Heelys now.
And he's dead. Hang on, I'm doing something. <laughs> I understand how, like, cold it must seem. Where every time someone's in danger, I always, like, loot the entire room first. What level is that? 14, that's it? You having trouble with a 14? Man, I'm level 10. And I have no problem with shit like this. Oh. Alright. Where is it? Oh, there it is. Oh. No one's touching you. I might eat this guy. <laughs> Not gonna lie. This is Bredo. I need someone who can read this. Oh. What? Hmm. What happened? Who are you? It's all right, sir. You're safe now. Oh, a fellow Englishman. Thank you, sir. For a moment, I thought those bloody heathens had kill me. What are you doing here? This place is not safe. Yeah, it's a cesspool, but it's mine. I came to collect some overdue rent, but those who still live here have gone completely bonkers. You're very lucky to be alive. Yeah, filthy immigrants, fucking savages, every one of them. And now with this bloody fever, they're just animals. You can find safety of sorts in Whitechapel. If you're quick and cautious, you'll be able to avoid the savages. Yummy. Was I that evil to deserve such punishment? My only regret is that no one will mourn me. For I have never been loved. The district will suffer? I don't think anyone even knew that guy. Probably should have waited to find out who he was a little bit longer. Well, I need experience. And he was there to give it to me. Now. Oh, I missed stuff on this body. I need to bounce. See, I, I got 100% sidetracked doing a different side quest that had nothing to do with me. Is the music supposed to make me feel bad? Because it doesn't. Makes me feel like I should have done it harder. Who was that, anyway? Where's the people? Here's the people. Uh. Yeah. Yeah, bruh, he's like down here. It's fine. Ooh, this guy. Wait, which district did I hit him? Damn it. Of course, it was from the one that I didn't want to rock the boat in. Where's the door out of here? I can't find the way out. I simply cannot find the way out. Does anyone know where the way out is? I can't find the way out. Should be right around here. Ah. So that was a that was I wouldn't say a waste of time, but it wasn't the best use of my time. I need to go find this dude and then I need to um 
go on to the main quest. I do want to get at least two or three main quests done in every video, and I know I'm already, this one's already getting kind of long. So, whoa. Am I tracking the right quest? Succeeded, succeeded. Oh? Uh? Ah. See, no investigations. All those are done right now. Let's say I got two. But this is the one I'm working on. It's 130 meters that way. Uh, a lot of backtracking to get where you need to go. Ah! This is the hospital. Can I use the... Br I can. If I go far enough this way... I should be able to find another bridge, and that other bridge will take me across to where I need to be. Right? Why can't I get over there? Wait, map it? Okay, so I just need to go, I need to follow this building back. I thought that sleeping dude was in there by himself for a minute. I'm like, oh yeah, I can finally get to see him, but. Ain't the case. Oh, is this that last district? No. Don't die with money, and I won't take the money off your body. Oop. Good. Don't really want to fight you. But I will. Ow. Ow. I don't like fighting every single encounter I have to I have, I come across. But I will do it if that's what you continue to demand of me. Damn straight, I'm fast. Oh. Oh, damn it. You're just gonna watch. Uh oh, the cemetery. Is this is this the other um district? It's not. I wanna find the last district really bad. Sorry, sir. No admittance. Did you hear me? There's one of them! <laughs> I gotta admit, that was a pretty cool way to start a conversation. Ow. Oh, yeah, he's only four levels ahead of me. The other guy was six. He died even faster than you. Damn. I'm good. Alright, let's... Let's find this dude. There's a whole bunch of monsters here, yeah. Wait, on the map. Oh, I'm not even going the right way. He's back this way somewhere. And I ain't gonna fight fights I don't need to fight. <laughs> it takes up time. What? Window in distress? Okay. Working on it. Oh, 
What do you mean, who am I? What do I want? Ow. Yep. I was trying to bite him, but then my fingers got all off the keys. Die already. Somebody help. <laughs> Hello. How many points are you, are you worth? All right, miss. I, I don't know. Who were those people? They, they, they wanted to kill me. Why? They've lost their minds in the epidemic. They won't come back for now. You seem to know a lot about them, sir. I'm Dr. Jonathan Reed. I'm investigating this disease. I am Shaoshun. Thank you so much for helping me, Mr. Reed. I must go to the cemetery now. Goodbye. Damn it. I tried. I tried Can't to... It. Is Father Whitaker's disciple among... Th this man's far too old to be Samuel. No. By the look of his clothes, this man's a docker. It's locked, all right. Samuel isn't here. I had better follow the blood trail. Which blood trail? Out the window? Did I finish Widow in Distress? Is that done? Is there something I can do for you? Shouldn't you go back home, where you'll be safe? Maybe later. But for now, I need to talk to my husband at the cemetery, Mr. Reed. Okay. Okay, weirdo. I need to track the quest I was I was doing, which is this one. Okay. So Uh-oh. As I feared, Samuel no longer preaches the good word. Well, it is what it is. <laughs> Oh, this is it. This is Samuel. So he gets turned into his uh, into a uh, vampire. It just automatically gets level uh, sixteen. I call bullshit on that. <laughs> just beating this shit out of him. He clearly doesn't know how to be a vampire. Die already, damn! Report to Father Whitt- Oh! Is there stuff on the ground I could take? That's a rat! I got 300 meters to travel. I gotta get out of the graveyard. I would really like to not be in a graveyard anymore, if you don't mind. Also, wouldn't mind taking out some dude of, uh... I want to take out someone of importance, so that way I can level up real good. It's just me. I don't know how to get out of here. Ah, here we go. Oh, 
Alright. Best be moving on. Man, I just took out so much more than you can handle. Like, I ain't even kidding you, man. You ain't shit. Thanks for the screws. Where the hell am I supposed to go? How am I supposed to get back? How am I supposed to get back? Oh, I gotta go through the church. This way. Not the church, the hospital. Is the camera lopsided? Is the camera lopsided right now? How long has the camera been lopsided? Is it lopsided? No, well, a little. It's not bad, though. Sorry about that. I didn't know that was happening. Alright, here we go. Safe house? Am I finding ways to get around? Wait, now I'm in the cemetery again. Wait, let me back over there. I don't want to deal with that shit again. Wait, I want to go up there. I want to be up there. Thank you. Got to go around the building, back out there. Man, this episode's like get like get coming to the point where I need to end it, and I haven't done a single damn uh <laughs> a single main quest. It's all been side quests. And that's fine, it's just... Kind of wanted to do a main quest. I'm gonna. I'm not ending this episode without doing at least one. I did open this, correct? Yes, I did. Okay, good. I don't like having to fight every 35 seconds. It's good for the experience bar. But it gets repetitive for viewers. It would get repetitive for me as a viewer, so... I don't know. I feel like you guys wouldn't want to see me fight constantly. Every now and then, sure, but not constantly. I don't know where Father Whitaker is. I don't like Father Whitaker, and I will be killing him. Is he the main pillar of the, of the society here? I'm gonna guess that he is. He isn't. Okay, so I, yeah, I'll be I'll be killing him. It's a big one. I gotta get to mesmerize level five though. Honestly, that probably keeps pe people from killing important people too quickly. I don't know how the fudge to get there though. I'm wasting the rest of this episode running around trying to figure out what the hell's going on. Where the hell to go? Get out of this place. Get, whoops. There's outside, there's upstairs. Okay, look, 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 look. This is not what I thought it was. This is not the correct path. We're gonna go around this way, right? Yeah. What's in here? Oh, I would like to evolve. Extra stand in the minute, A thousand points, that's all my points into stamina. And I need to be level 12 to do the next one. So I do have max, uh, oh, I can do ultimate stuff? What is that? I'm gonna have to, uh, sorry, I didn't mean to do that. Fine, he was useless. I'm gonna check out my uh, investigation updated. Is this where I came from? That's where I came from. This is where I need to go. Nope, nope, nope. They can't hit me if I keep moving. Nope, you're wrong and stupid and dumb and stupid. Nope. Nope. Oh, shit. 
Whoa. I'm now level 11. You're next, Broham. Oh, another one. Alright. I mean, I'm not worried about it. See, the bite I use to safely recover stamina. That's, that's why I bite so much. I can recover stamina without having to worry about getting hurt. Alright, zoom up there. Where's Father Whitaker? really hate that bastard, and I will be murdering him at some point. If the story doesn't do it for me, I will be doing it. Where the hell am I, man? Okay, so apparently I'm close. According to the map, anyway. What's this? I literally just looked at that. I cannot enter. Go around. Bro, I just need into the church. That's it. Just let me into the damn church. What am I doing? What am I doing in this? That, that woman out there is still... What are you doing out here, weirdo? Good evening, miss. I'm Dr. Reed. I'd like to ask you a few questions. I... Whoops. Amelia, I know you work for Dorothy Crane. Please tell me about her secret dispensary. Hmm. A stubborn and mute comrade. Nurse Crane and Darius Petrescu have been clever. Oh, damn. I know you understand what I'm saying. Your silence has nothing to do with you being mute, does it? Very well. Goodbye, then. I need in this damn church, bruh. Okay. The content of Darius' letter to his children could give me more leverage to enter. That's... Smart. That's literally who I need to be talking to. The stammering fool. Good evening, Mr. Whitaker. It's Father Whitaker, my son. So, are you still lost in your <laughs> rational delusions? I have found Samuel, your disciple. I am afraid I have bad news. I already expected the worst. He should already have come back. He is dead, isn't he? Yes, he is now. The epidemic took him. Samuel steadily made donations to our cause. He would have rewarded you himself if you'd found me in that awful cemetery. Please accept this money. Don't you fear getting sick yourself? I've been touched by God's grace. Hmm. Okay, so... I have heard of... Okay, Holy Crusade's done. I'm not going back for that woman in this episode. Uh, I'm going to actually do the main quest for a second. 
which would be to go back here. Man, I want my mesmerized level to go up. Blew me away, I found one of them right there. This close to home base. I can't see. I can't see. Oh, I clicked. Oh. Die. Is what it is. I ate him and I ate him good. I got to get back here to talk to the dude. Find Richard in the area. Are you Richard? Good evening, sir. I'm Dr. Reed. I would like to ask you a few questions. Please be my guest. Although I may not be the best informant regarding this part of town, my words speak about that which the eyes cannot see. Really? Are you an artist of some kind? I'm a poet, sir. Richard Nithercott, at your service. May I ask you a few questions about the district? Extraordinary part of town, is it not? I'll be glad to help you, if I can. What can you tell me about an old man called Darius? Darius Petrescu? Yes, I know him. At first, I thought he was only a small publisher. I invited him to publish my work, but his reaction was pretty clear. Not interested in your talent? Darius is an old political activist who takes delight in printing tracts and lampoons. Those communist activities only require mediocre writing skills. Okay. I'm looking for Dorothy Crane, a nurse who lives in this vicinity. Dorothy Crane. Oh, I love the name. The Crane of Whitechapel. Sounds very mysterious. But, sorry, no, never heard of her. If I eat you... Oh, yeah, the cold, okay. I'll leave you... Darius is a bit less of a mystery now. It should not be that difficult to incite him to let me in. I'm going to get into his house. Like, right now. I think I'm upping these to an hour long, so that way I can... I don't have to stop playing so much. This is my second episode of the day, and I'm making a third one after this, and then probably an episode of Minecraft after that, because with my job being in an outage right now, it's work, 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 work. I just got off of a 85-hour week, and today I got lucky enough to only have to work four hours. Welcome, sir. Please, take a browse of my wares. I am Dr. Reed. Doctor? Okay, hang on. Goodbye for Who's that other guy? You. Look like he was mafia-ing that guy. Excuse me, sir. I have a few questions for you. Another journalist? I didn't answer the first one, so piss off! I'm not a journalist, I'm a doctor. A doctor, you say? It's quite a rare breed in this part of town. Really? But still, here I am. Dr. Jonathan Reed, at your service. I'm Joe Peterson to some, but Colossus Joe to most. And I don't remember asking for your service, sir. Have you heard of a nurse named... Dorothy Crane? Yeah, I'll know her. One of the few good souls who dare to... Could you please tell me more? She's a nice girl. Tries to help the migrants. I offered to give her a hand, but she said my reputation would attract too much attention. Okay, so I'm gonna eat him. I'm trying to uncover everybody here. Goodbye, Mr. I will eat that guy. Colossus Joe.
Mr. Petrescu, just one minute, please. You again? Go away. Sir, wait. Stop this nonsense. I know Nurse Crane is here. Shall we speak man to man, you and I? <laughs> All right. Speak up. Don't you see we're on the same side? We fight to help the poor, sick, and abandoned. I'm nothing like you, Mr. Doctor. Yes, you are. You too believe in providing medical care without charge. You know what we have to sacrifice to make the world a better place. I have to admit your words have conviction. All right, I'll let you see Dorothea. Don't make me regret this, though. Nice. Wait a sec. What if I talk to him a little bit more? I want to talk to Dorothea. We've not. I am Darius Petrescu. I know you fought for your country when it was occupied, Darius. Tell me more about it. I know my days are numbered, and I know I won't see my homeland. I feel like squeezing him for info is a good idea. Romania oh, Romania! He's a Dracula boy. But Romania escaped the grasp of the Austro-Hungarian Empire. It's a free country again. But it's not the country I fought for. My homeland is not a beast, Doctor. But I still see a dark future ahead for my people. How did you meet Nurse Crane, Darius? Why does she trust you? I'm her oldest friend. You mean occupied Romania, to Really? Goodbye, Mr. Petrescu. I learned things. Hang on, real quick, I'm gonna run around your house, take the things I think look good enough for me to take. Just real quick while I loot. I'm gonna talk to her, I'm gonna find a safe house. Uh, and then I'll end the episode, but I'm gonna record another one. gonna sneak around here and steal all the shit they're using to save people. Man, you, you can handle it for just another second. What do we have here, nurse? Patient Razvan Vasily. High fever running on three days. Complaints of dizziness, muscle aches, head pain, diagnosed with influenza. Treatment? Aspirin and salicin for the fever and discomfort. Liquids for dehydration, but he's having trouble keeping even water down. Thank you, nurse. Anything else I should know? He did lose consciousness this morning, but he's never had convulsions like these. He's not convulsing, he's choking. He's not getting any air. Skull! Hand me that skull. Oh God, I don't. What can I do, Doctor? I'm gonna look at you guys. It's too dangerous to operate with these convulsions. Sedative, nurse. Do we have any anesthetics? I'm sorry, Doctor. None at all. Sounds like a vampire. Yikes! Yikes! I need to perform a tracheostomy. Short pipe. That rubber tube will do. We're going to cut a passage for air through the neck. Yes, Doctor. Uh, <sighs> uh, he's again, but he's coughing up blood. Uh, hemorrhaging. I need to make another incision into the chest cavity to drain the fluids from the lung. Prepare uh, another tube. A thoracostomy. Doctor, we've nothing to fight the infection. We need an aseptic environment. Right then, Nurse Crane. What do you suggest we do? I have no idea. I'm not the doctor. Time is of the essence. We need to perform a thoracic drain. Yes, doctor. I hate this. He's still bleeding, doctor. I'm losing his pulse. The drain must have punctured the intercostal artery. 
There's too much blood. Are you all right, Doctor? I... I can't see. I must... First, suture the artery. Find the wound. The source of the blood. Needle and thread, Doctor. Mm, I hate this. Good. The stitches are holding. How's he doing? We're losing him. We've lost his pulse. He's dying, Doctor. Cardiac massage. Now. Cardiac... What? Are you making this up as you go along? Yes. Yes, I am. I don't know how to do this. I'm sure there was a way We've around that. pulse. He's gone, Doctor. Yes. We did everything we could. Truly? Everything you could. Is that how you'll report this in your log? Is this how the war went? Piling up one poor corpse beside the next? This was not an influenza-induced seizure. I've never seen symptoms like these on the continent. Neither have I. But the previous symptoms leading up to this attack were the same, indistinguishable from the epidemic. No. There was something more vile in these reactions. Something... primitive. There have been numerous reports of mental breakdowns caused by the fever that accompanies the flu itself, Doctor. Yes, but... I'd best take some samples of the blood for analysis. I hated every bit of that. Very well made. For the love of God, that freaked me out. Kind of want to drink Dorothy. To test my bedside manners. No. I suspect it was more than intuition alone that led you to us. So, how might I be of service, Doctor Reed? I've come to put an end to this insufferable blackmailing, Dorothy. Doctor, you think your warnings scare me? I've stolen and plied, blackmailed and lied, but what else am I to do? I'm all these people have. You've convinced me of the sincerity of your actions and their noble justifications. But all the same, blackmail is a crime, and it will stop Nurse Crane. So, are you going to turn me over to the authorities? Oh. Oh no. Oh no. What am I supposed to do? This is stressful because I want the experience. But she is kind of a good person. She's helping people. No. Your place is here. Jailing you would be an even greater crime. So? Here is my proposition. I'll look the other way on your little enterprise. In exchange, you will resign from the Pembroke Hospital and provide me with medical supplies when the need arises. Dr. Reed, that sounds like a business proposition. My accomplice then? No, just a privileged client. My research may require the occasional rare piece of equipment or ingredient. I'll pay good coin in exchange, fair and honest. To help finance your noble endeavors. We have ourselves a deal, Doctor. 
Good customers are always welcome. Yes, Nurse Crane. We have a deal. Could always just kill her anyway. New citizens available. To <gasps> Did my mesmerized level go up? Did my mesmerized level go up? Did my mesmerized level go up? It did. Okay. Uh, I need to find a place to stop because I've locked, gone right. too it's long. Locked, right. This episode. Why are these guys here? How did they find the place? What? What? Michaela's texting me about the new uh, Mario Kart on the cell phone. Only a level 12. Need to juice up my stamina just a bit. And now eat him. And now eat him again. Holy shit. Okay. I want to know how they found this place. How they knew where I would be. There is a safe house directly ahead. Where? I don't. A swamper cordial can be the answer to all your problems, as long as you have the money. Huh. Ain't that some? I think it's right here. Damn, this episode's been crazy. If you're not strong enough, remember that the blood of citizens is the fast way to evolve. Stop tempting me. I almost uh, ate the nurse there. This episode's been a little extra long, and I apologize for that. It's not supposed to be this long. Not even a little. I have so much experience, it's insane. Where's the bed? Where's the bed? Where's the bed? Where's the bed? Is it upstairs? I bet you it's upstairs. Poof. We're gonna evolve, and then we're gonna end the episode. Okay, what is ultimate? Oh, that's cool. Coming to life. Blood Cauldron. Rage. Ooh. Well, first... St oh, I can't do more stamina. Can I? Wait, what was that? No, I can't do more stamina. It looked like I could, though. Alright. Um, let's see. What is this? Drain oh, I can upgrade my... Oh, good lord. Um. Shit. <laughs> I don't know what I want to... I might buy a bunch of cheap stuff. See? There we go. That heals me a bit more. We're going to get this. Wait, no, no, no. I want this one. Okay, so see that absorbs damage. I want an ultimate. That's a thousand. That's a thousand. And that's a thousand. Of course it is. They're all a thousand. Um. Shadow Mist. Science. No, 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 no. I need. Oh, I need more blood. That's something I need. Ah, I don't know if that. Increase your blood absorption. That's what I need. How much for more health? A thousand. Don't have it. 
Let's get this. I can't. That's a lot. What about you? 500. 500. 600. 1300. Yeah, no, I'm going to save the rest. Nice. All right. You guys, be sure to check in for the next one because we are getting super... Oh. Okay, hang on. Look at this. Oh, 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 oh. I got the last one. Uh. Nice. Okay. So, we've met everyone but two here. We've met everyone but one here. We got a lot of work to do here. And got a lot of work to do everywhere else. Okay. Be sure to check in for the next one because I want to see you there.